MFK pup screamer. Gray fox distress, coon distress. You just saw what it do to a coon. I imagine we blew his face off. That's 10 steps and still coming. Dave 22250, I'm sure done a number on him. We come out here to coyote hunt. We made a coyote stand, didn't have any luck. Good looking spot for coons. Got a corn field behind us. That crap, we'll swap over and see if we can pull us a coon out of the deal. At least get some fur out of the set. And sure enough, there he is. Didn't take long. Pretty good sized coon. We called up another one just a second ago. But, uh, coon distress on the pup screamer. Pulling them in. We're going to go get another couple coons, I think, before it gets dark. Uh, might even make another cow stand if we got time. Grab his coon, see what he looks like, and we'll go get another one.
there it is again. Three in a row. New MFK pup screamer. Coon Distress is a new sound we figured out we could do on this call, and it's been awesome. We're pulling them in left and right. Deadly on Gray Fox, too. But uh, we're going to grab this one. This coon come in quick, so it's a good chance we can run out here and pick us up another one somewhere. We're going to try to do that right quick. I'm going to grab this one see what he looks like. Yeah, baby, I like it. MFK all day. Been to get enough. Come with me. Here's the deal with this spot. Uh, this late in the evening, been raining all afternoon. Uh, I've been at the shop mountain deer. Didn't have much time to go coyote hunting, didn't have time to get anywhere. And uh, we've been testing out this new pup screamer on coons in the daytime. And uh, anyway, I said, really quit raining. I had just a little bit uh, time left before dark, didn't have anywhere to go coyote hunting quick. So I just walked out here behind my house, and even changed clothes. Uh, left the taxidermy shop, grabbed my calls, grabbed my gun, run out here. I ain't 200 yards behind my house. And uh, it's a little old creek winds down through here. A big old barn, and I've known for years past that trapping this is a good place for coons. So uh, I grabbed my stuff, sat down. Wasn't probably five minutes into the call. Big old boar coon. I guess he'd come up this creek or either come from behind me. He was right there beside my pants the time I seen him. I mean, he wasn't five feet from my boot. Done spooked and left. The ground's real wet from the rain. I didn't hear him coming. And uh, the time I saw him, got the camera turned, he was leaving. So uh, I hope I got the footage. Hope I got some of the coon for the shot. Uh, all my buddies is working today, so had to come in here and do it, you know, by myself. That filming yourself is always hard, especially trying to get the footage in the kill. But uh, it's some fun stuff, something you can, uh, if you ain't got time to do, uh, if you don't have time to go somewhere and hunt a bigger predator, like a coyote, fox, bobcat, which is what we typically try to get after, uh, target these coons. I mean, they're you know, everywhere, around town. You can hunt them anywhere. and it, it's fun calling. Uh, I'm going to walk over and get this thing. Uh, take a look at him. Probably a big old boar coon. That's what you usually call up. I'm going to grab him and uh, drag him up here. We'll take a look at him. What I figured he'd be. Big old uh, boar coon. That's the thing about these, uh, this coon calling. Uh, just about every coon we call in is a is a big boar coon just like this one uh, a lot of times their ears will be chewed off you're calling in older more aggressive coons most of the time occasionally we'll call in a sow or a, a small young coon but not very often 
And uh, don't get discouraged if you see a coon come down a tree, a smaller coon, and leave uh, rather than come to the call because it does it does scare some of the less aggressive smaller coons. And uh, that's what these coons are coming to do. These big boar coons is coming in here to this call to fight. And uh, they're real aggressive to the call. Makes them a lot of fun to hunt. And uh, I'm gonna go see if I can kill another one. I got enough time to make maybe one or two more stands. That's another good thing about these, uh, these coons and coon calling. Usually five, six, seven, eight minutes is all you need to sit there. If he ain't there by then, hop up and move to another spot. Get more fur that way. Go see if we can get another one. MFK all day.